I've made millions eating crab online and here is how I did it. The most I've earned from one single video, probably 180,000. I roughly make $1.3 million from YouTube every year. Um, I just eat. I'm not trying to be pretty with it. I'm not trying to look cute. I wipe my mouth when I want to wipe my mouth and that's it. Today we're gonna be doing a mukbang. And what a mukbang is, is me eating a large amount of food in front of my audience on YouTube. I like to do everything big. That's what brings people to my channel. And my average views a month is over 14 million. I also get paid from sponsorships and brand deals. Between 15,000, a shout out, to 20,000. Seafood is not cheap at all. I can pay over $1,000 for my seafood feast. My um, stomach is growling as we speak. <laughs> the thumbnail is everything in YouTube. You have to get people to want to click on the video. So this is why you will see me having a big massive amount of food in front of me, even though I don't eat it all. The studio is already set up. Just make sure her lighting is good. I'm very super -de duper excited to eat all this food. What's up my beloved? You guys, today I got Curtis the Crab in the building. A lot of people are scared to eat like this. Y'all seen his lungs? Ooh, that's the lungs of Curtis. Y'all always be asking, what's inside of Curtis? What's under the hood? And of course, you can't eat that part. That's all that white meat. That, that, that good meat, y'all. That's that yum, yum, good. Up in there, I eat in a way that I don't overstuff myself. I used to do videos that, ooh, challenges and stuff. Well, I stopped doing them because it took a toll on me. I was miserable. 80% of my videos is seafood. I do do other videos, fried chicken or maybe a burger here or there, but I'm not too big on it, so. Feels so good. Mukbang started out in Korea. My younger son told me about these videos that did inspire me. Cause I always wanted to do YouTube. It was just a hobby. After four months, I noticed that I was really getting a lot of attention and the money was going up. And then I just thought that if I do this full time, instead of going to work nine to five, it would really take off. We are a family of four. And we pretty much are a social media influencer family. My sons do YouTube and my husband manages us. I think the whole, t the whole time it'll take me to edit this video might be 20 minutes. I'm very happy, very pleased with the coloring. The more videos that I upload to YouTube, the more money I get paid. I start branching out doing ASMR videos probably a year and a half into my mukbang. ASMR videos more like people that get tingles when they hear the sounds. Sometimes it takes away their anxiety. Now this particular style of video is where you need headphones. All of my um, headphones are custom made, individually got jeweled. So this is about $7,200 in headphones. I'm the type of person that like a lot of bling and everything. I like to spend my money by shopping, um, going on vacation. My most expensive purse is 30 grand. I get negativity, you know, and that comes with social media, that's expected. But I get more love than negativity. What really drives me, it has a lot to do with my audience because a lot of them depend on me, on my videos. And then, of course, the money drives me. I know I just gotta keep going and keep pushing to make a legacy for my family. I don't only wanna be a YouTuber, I just wanna be a household name. 